this is Ashu Bashri. I completed my UG in uh, Raja Rajeshwari Medical College in Hospital, which is uh, near uh, uh, Kambipura, Kengeri, Bangalore. And uh, firstly speaking uh, about the campus, uh, it's one of the best best campus we have uh, in our uh, uh, medical college and hospital. We have separate blocks like uh, for each and everything uh, the hospital as well as uh, uh, the college and we have separate hostels for girls and boys in UGs and a separate hostel for uh, uh, interns as well as PGs and we have uh, staff quarters and everything like gym, swimming pool, um, a big playground for sports and uh, basketball court, badminton court, everything is available there and as well as for the um, students who live in the hostel there all the facilities like all the necessary items is also available nearby itself. Um, on the whole it's one of the best uh, medical college and hospital in uh, Bangalore as well as in Karnataka. Uh, we have an auditorium there uh, for food we have a mess uh, in the hostel for both boys and girls as well as we have canteen there and many stalls uh, there for all the varieties of food from many uh, states of uh, India. The people come from many states of India and they can uh, have their own uh, I mean, variety of foods there. Also there is a separate library uh, in the medical college itself uh, where you can uh, um, uh, study there uh, like peacefully and also we have a study room separately. If you have your own separate books you can go to the study room and study there also. If not you can go to the library also. Uh, I am a 2016 batch uh, student uh, in RRMCH and coming to the first year uh, basically we had three subjects anatomy physiology and biochemistry for which uh, uh, all the subject we had different labs uh, for anatomy we had a dissection lab where uh, actually many cadavers were provided for us to learn like each and everything in anatomy we used to learn in the lab itself it was one of the most and the best memories we have uh, in uh, uh, I mean in medical college in the dissection lab and then uh, we had physiology as well as biochemistry uh, we had separate labs for those two like teachers were very supportive and how many times we used to go to them they used to clear uh, like each and every silly doubts also they used to clear uh, uh, in the labs and in the classes also and then uh, coming to uh, second year we had four subjects uh, pathology microbiology pharmac and uh, forensic medicine and uh, for forensic medicine we saw many many post-mortem cases uh, there in uh, RRMCH and pathology, microbiology and pharmacology were also very interesting like um, many experiments we used to do there and uh, before uh, exams they used to revise all the experiments also uh, and they used to provide, provide so much of confidence uh, uh, for us uh, before exams also and uh, from third year uh, has all the clinical subjects uh, uh, were started we used to go to uh, college uh, sorry hospital itself where uh, like um, all the patients uh, the pgs as well as srs professors hod's uh, in all the subjects they are very friendly and they are very good and they used to teach us uh, each and every case uh, and we used they used to give us uh, uh, like presentations to do uh, in each and every case to learn uh, by ourselves and to gain more knowledge uh, and we had uh, uh, ophthalmology uh, community medicine and uh, ENT in third year and for community medicine uh, we had postings uh, like uh, in many villages uh, like Chunchun Gupa and all we used to go there uh, we used to uh, go to each and every house we used to take family histories and all uh, and that was quite interesting part there uh, the community medicine postings coming to the final year uh, we had all the major subjects like uh, obstetrics and gynecology medicine general surgery pediatrics dharma radio and all uh, they'll cover in fourth year as our batch uh, uh, was uh, quite uh, 
uh, unlucky that we had uh, COVID that time. Around eight to nine months, uh, uh, we were not able to go to any uh, like hospitals. We were not able to see any cases. Um, at that time, uh, our professors used to conduct classes online itself. Like they used to teach every uh, like chapters, every single detail. So they used to teach us online, and they used to give assignments to do and uh, practicals also uh, we had uh, online like uh, many all the subjects like many months we had online and we missed many classes uh, because of covid and uh, even though we missed classes like last two to three months uh, we ha uh, the college had conduct uh, uh, extra classes before the exams so that we could uh, go to the hospital we could see few patients before the exams like uh, for each and every subject uh, we got uh, minimum of like um, two to three weeks of practical courses in uh, uh, last few months before the exam and that was very very helpful for us uh, now coming to our uh, internship days where uh, we used to have uh, like uh, every month our postings used to change and first month we actually had covid uh, uh, postings uh, and then from second month uh, uh, the proper internship started for us uh, uh, first we had obstetrics and gynecology for one month where uh, we used to go to labor room for uh, like few days around 10 days and then we used to go to ward for 10 days another 10 days and uh, ICUs also we had uh, like um, they used to give uh, chances for us uh, um, like in the OTs as well in uh, obstetrics and gynecology as well as in general surgeries we used to go to OTs um, and then uh, we had medicine in medicine we had all the other super specialty postings also like um, gastroenterology and um, psychiatry postings was also there and uh, many other uh, uh, subdivisions in uh, super uh, in medicine uh, for super specialty postings also we had and then uh, surgery also like many uh, neurosurgeries uh, postings and uh, cardiothoracic uh, ctbs uh, as well as uh, 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 other uh, super specialties also uh, postings we had so they used to post us every in each and every aspect of the subject so we used to have uh, uh, knowledge in everything of that subject and then uh, uh, coming to the community medicine postings we had uh, uh, a few days in uh, chunchun Guppe as well as uh, chanpatna uh, kr harli uh, like uh, many other villages and all we used to Ago and we used to take the history of the patients and um, if they had any other problems we used to refer to our college so that um, uh, it will be useful for them as well as even we can learn um, uh, by the patients as uh, the patients are the most uh, uh, I mean the learning uh, aspect is only from the patients uh, in medical colleges and the most important thing is that uh, the one which I like in our college is that the college has been tied up with the Ayushman Bharat scheme where the college provides a free treatment for uh, uh, many people like below the poverty line people and all they provide free treatment and that's one of the most uh, uh, the best thing from the college has even we could get many patients uh, to learn and there are uh, uh, the college conducts many camps uh, for uh, in all the subjects like uh, obstetrics and gynecology uh, general surgeries medicine and uh, ophthalmology also where uh, especially in ophthalmology like each and every week we used to go to the camps and uh, like many patients used to come about 100 patients used to come uh, there to the to our college and we used to do free cataract surgeries for many patients there and CT West department also they uh, they had conducted around 100 free cardiac surgeries uh, in our college uh, like each and every uh, modernized technologies uh, are um, available in the college so we can like completely update to the present uh, modern uh, uh, OT as well as uh, um, procedures everything uh, it's very informative as well as we'll get many like hands on experiences so that um, we can learn many things uh, in internship like same as the doctors we can learn many things in internship RRMCH celebrates uh, literally all the festivals uh, in India so that 
the people coming from many states they would never miss their festivals uh, uh, to be honest like uh, all the festivals onam dashara deepavali ganesh chaturthi like all the festivals they do celebrate there christmas everything and uh, uh, also we have uh, uh, many uh, fests there like in each and every year we used to have fests around 3 to 5 days fests we had in our mch where uh, they used to conduct the cultural competitions uh, like antakshari singing rangoli dance bharatanatyam uh, like uh, everything in the cultural activities and also the sports many sports many sports were there cricket basketball table tennis hockey and like all the carrom chess every all the sports where if you are interested you can uh, participate and you can even win awards there and uh, also we had uh, uh, graduation day like uh, all every year we used to have graduation day and um, sp speaking our graduation day was one of the best memories we have and we had in our mch uh, like uh, it was the most amazing day there uh, since morning morning we went and we enjoyed a lot in RRMCH there, like many guests were there and governors were also invited in uh, uh, graduation day and uh, we had like, uh, we can't, I can't even speak in words about the memories in uh, RRMCH that we made memorable it's memorable in RMCH it's like um, it includes all the things like studying enjoyment cultural uh, sports everything you can uh, see in RMCH and you can enjoy literally each and every day in RMCH it's very nice